This is a barbell supine bridge. So we've got a bar set up here on the ground with bumper plates on either side. So that's an important thing to note here. If you're not using 45 pound plates, which have a very thick diameter, you want to use bumper plates so that bar is adequately far off the ground here. We've also got a, a bar pad here on the middle here. So that'll go around the middle so we're covering your waist so that the bar, the metal part, isn't in contact with the hips. Alternatively, you could take a yoga mat or something and roll that around there. Just something to give you a little bit of padding so it's not uncomfortable on your hips as you perform the exercise. So what Peter's going to do here with his legs straight, he's going to roll the bar over so that now the pad is on top of his hips. He's going to lie his back down here. He's going to bend his legs so his feet are flat on the floor here, about a 90 degree angle or so between his knee and shin here. Okay? So from this position, he's going to relax his head back, brace his anterior core, so making sure he's starting from a position of like neutral spinal alignment. So we don't want to start from a position where he's really flared out in front because then he's going to feel this a lot and he's going to be moving through his low back, all right? So if you're feeling it through your lower back instead of your hamstrings and glutes, you want to make sure that anterior core is braced and a slight posterior tilt of the pelvis. So you're starting from a more neutral position. Now from here, with that anterior core brace, what Peter's going to do is he's going to push into the ground through his heels and midfoot, bringing his hips up. So he's going to have a straight line between his shoulders, hips, and knees, all right? So as he does that, hips come up. Good. You want to squeeze the glutes at the top. So in this lockout position, you want to try to go squeezing your glutes. You should feel that in your hamstrings as well, not in your lower back, as we said before. So for this one, you come up, squeeze at the top for a moment, go back down under control. Sometimes this will be programmed with a specific tempo. So for instance, you might come up, hold it for a three-second count, go back down, and repeat that for the prescribed number of repetitions.